everybody and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to start my garden transformation if you'd watched my last vlog you'd have known that i've still not, not got my washing machine in i'm waiting on mark getting up so we can put it in but the sun is beautiful there's no better time to start this garden if you ask me i'm just sat here outside having my coffee and looking at what i've got to do and it's not fun I've got so much to do. I don't know if I'm going to get it all done today. I may have to be taken into tomorrow, but I know you guys are understanding and you, you'll um, you'll obviously bear with me. So I'm going to have my coffee now and then we're going to plumb in this washing machine. Right, this is my new washing machine. So far, so good. It's got nine minutes left. I've just put it on a quick wash just to see if it worked. It is filthy though it's obviously just been sat in a garage or something i need to clean it i just wanted to see that it worked before i cleaned it there was no point doing all that and not so that's why it's not fully put back in yet because we just wanted to see that it wasn't leaking or anything so so far it's got seven minutes left i don't know if you can see and it's still working the only problem is it's a smaller drum than my old one so i oh god i just don't know what i'm gonna do and this morning i found out i got an email from my car insurance that that's gone up by literally double i was paying 36 or 37 i'm now going to be paying like 90 a month i've looked online and i have to pay deposits on all the others so i don't know i'm just worried to death about all money isn't it all the time no matter what you seem to do anyway we plugged out excuse me darling we were just trying our car chat mark's just shouted at me because these things i tried to thread on there on the tap and I lost, sorry about the state of the place. And I um, I de-threaded it or something apparently. So I've got to get a brush to do the gut, the fence anyway. So when I do that, I'll get one of them. But I think that all works fine. So that was a bargain. I think he just can't wait to play with it really. That's why he's all in the mood. But yeah, anyway, anyway, anyway let me show you the garden bit first. That's the side panel that goes on the side there. So that bit one. And yeah, just look, Sweepy's old bed and old scooters and that needs a clean. I think that's why he wants to get the jet wash out as well. Like chairs and whiteboards and bikes and that's the fence that needs painting. Cause I've, and I need, and that one, and I need sort of touching up and that desperately needs it as well. Cause it's got all mossy stuff over it. And yeah, this is just the state of the place. I wanted to get for these white bits just here. We used to have outside tap there, so that's what that is, but we had to take it out. I wanted to get those like trellises, those green trellises things. So maybe next time I get some money, I might get some of them. But we can't do that today, obviously. But anyway, yeah, so this is the before. It's just, oh, and look at all the weeds I've got to do. The slabs have never been cleaned since we've had this garden. We've been in this house like 11 years. No cleaning, so yeah. As you can see, that's the before. But it is a beautiful day on the upside. So, yeah. I'm going to hang these couple of towels out because that's all I've got. And then we're going to go and get a paintbrush and a new one of these things. So, I'll let you know how we get on. Nobody told me to settle down. Day, nights and late nights. Don't get around But there's something about you Something about you I like About you I like You're crazy for saying I should slow down But maybe I'm escaping The love we found There's something about you Something about you I like About you I like Get too drunk and too scared and lie to you If only you knew I would die for you One of us, one of us Gotta say the obvious Right, so now I'm on to the weeding. I hate weeding it's got to be the worst job ever and if you see i fall a couple of times look <laughs> where it's that hard I, I fall actually quite a lot during this i really did struggle to get these weeds out i, I just don't understand how grass can go grow through artificial grass as well because that's all artificial and you may notice like some faded bits behind that bench that's all real grass i don't know how this happens but it's so, so annoying for me. 
let me know if you're if you've got artificial grass and that happens to you actually because I, I can't stand it and this weeding literally it will be about a week and they'll all be back it's but never mind i i get on with it anyway but it is such a tedious job I just want to say quickly as well, thank you so much for all your lovely comments about the, um, well, basically about every video I put on, really. You all say the most kindest things. Honestly, joining YouTube and getting to know all you guys is one of the best things I've ever done in my life, other than my kids and obviously my marriage and things. You guys, I class you all as being my friends and I just can't believe how close I've become to some of you. It's just been, it's the best thing I've ever done. And I have got a totally different outlook on things now. I've, I've joined YouTube. It's really been the making of me to know that there's such kind people in the world because I didn't think that before I did YouTube. And now it's really proved me wrong. So thank you for all your lovely comments. You will never regret the things that we'll do. Cause I I've just weeded this bit and I've put the horse and the bike and things in the garage but the garage is sort of out the back there so I couldn't film it because I'd have been taking the tripod back and forward so that's sort of sorted and I just emptied this out and rearranged it a bit I put still looks a mess but I put because these are my sun loungers so they're easy to grab and I put all the logs and stuff for that Oz pig there so it's sort of a bit more sorted anyway because it was like piled up i put the cushions that were in there that's for the sofa so they're out ready uh my washing machine worked look it's hanging out those now um but it's disgusting it really is disgusting so i've got to go to tesco now clean um get some dishwasher cleaner i need to get a paintbrush for that and get some food Tonight we're running on the right track As usual, my little shadows there. Throughout this video, you will see a lot of the dogs and cats. Bobby has got... Look, they're sparky as well. Bobby has got such separation anxiety from me. It's awful. I feel so sorry for him. I really don't notice it till I watch these videos, how bad he really is. He's so cute. Bless him. He's by my side as I'm doing this voiceover as well. So, yeah, you'll see them a lot in this video.
right i've actually done all the weeding which is good um that has to be now cleaned with this jet wash but mark's got to put a it doesn't fit on the tap the thing we got so we're going to need to um fit some underneath the sink so he's going to do that now but i've got an absolutely banging headache so i'm just going to go and i think i'm going to lie down for just like half an hour or so and take some tablets until my head goes so um and then i'll come back and just like get rid of all these bits and things and then i'll paint the fence and things tomorrow so um i'll also film mark cleaning that with the uh karcher so that'll be something as well so yeah i'm just gonna lie down and i'll catch up with you when i wake up okay i'm up and about we still can't get anything for that mark's gonna get an outside tap tomorrow and fit it under the sink i'll show you tomorrow what i mean but i thought i've had a nap like i said this is my paint um that uh mark got this to paint the fence with i said that's the wrong brush but i did phone my mum and look at the animals it can't be without me oh all right i phoned my mum and i said can you use normal paintbrushes on fences and she said yes so i'm gonna um basically i'm gonna get it the first well do as much as i can now uh, that is the paint i'm using which is obviously that color that's there and yeah so i'm gonna do this now I have to say, painting the fence really, really hurt my shoulder. It's actually still hurting now. It was, I think it's because it's the same sort of motion over and over and over again. But, oh, I swear, I don't know how people do it. Like, I see the lady next door. She's always out there painting the fence. God knows how she does it. My shoulder was in bits. But, however, I do have a bad shoulder. But, um, I find watching this back quite therapeutic, actually. <laughs> So I hope you're enjoying it. everyone it's now the next day it's sunday i'm in my pajamas but i'm going to do it in my pajamas today um we never did anything else yesterday so now what we've got to do is i've got to paint this panel here that's the last one um, but look how well this turned out i did do another coat but i didn't film it because you don't need to see me do it twice and now we've got the jet wash working haven't we babe huh? we've got the jet wash working now yeah we've yeah. got it working finally we went to the range this morning and got an outside tap but the outside taps inside i'll show you in a minute anyway so he's got to clean this now and then we're going to um basically do all the slabs so that's done i've got the pat i've got a patio cleaner i don't know if it's any good but i just got this from the range when we went for a tap so do that and just see how far we can get today so as long as the big things are done and then i can do all the finishing touches tomorrow and get the video up for you guys so let's see how much we can get done today
Now, I did run into a little bit of a problem because that patio cleaner was only meant to be on dry slabs and he was obviously jet washing the Oz pig, that barbecue thing. So, um, yeah, I couldn't use the patio cleaner because it was still wet when I was jet washing the thing. So I had to just do my best with just the jet wash. However, it does need another going over, as you'll see once it's all finished. But like I say, I... Um, I did my best. I'm so annoyed because I really wanted to use the patio cleaner and just do it once rather than have to do it again. But it is what it is. right my battery died so i've just been charging it up so i've just given this a little paint that that's due a second coat but not yet because it's still drying so now um Mark cleaned this uh, with the jet wash, as you'd have seen. So now I'm just going to jet wash all the slabs. This is the first time I'm going to clean them since we've actually moved in. So let's see how they come up. Sometimes you think about all the ways I'm making you smile. I'm uh, in my bikini top, as you can see. I got a bit hot, especially doing this. But look at the difference. Like, that is really bad. I'm actually ashamed. Look at that. That is, like, they're, like, totally different colour slabs. I didn't even know what colour they were, to be honest. But can you believe I got this jet wash and the washing machine that works fine for £65. Just honestly... People, go and look for secondhand stuff first. Do not just go straight in there and buy everything new because, you know, if you can save some money, why not? Look what I did. I know it's a bit of faff going to collect it and things, but it's definitely worth it. Honestly, go save yourself some money and go and buy secondhand.
okay sort of halfway through it's gonna need another like couple of going overs as you can see but look at the difference that's the old color this is the new like that is insane but like as you can see all the muds come out of all the little cracks and it's all washed down there so they're going to need another going over as well so i think today i'm going to finish off doing this bit of the slabs here because i've got to wait for my washing to dry because that's all the kids school shirts and things so i need to get that done so i'm going to do this bit today and maybe do the grass jet wash all the, that um, but if not i'll be doing that tomorrow so yeah it's turned into a three day oh, nothing's ever done easy is it three days to do this and obviously i'll do all the finishing touches put all the covers out and that tomorrow and put all the lights up and get some flowers for fluffy's grave over there and why don't you focus thank you so yeah so that's where we're up to so far So you can see what a difference that has done obviously there is still little bits and things it's not how it should be but this is the first time we've done it in literally years so um i'll go over it again maybe next weekend or something so yeah i'm going to now put all this back here and um then i might actually call it a day till tomorrow and finish sorting everything out tomorrow because I'm still waiting on that washing drying, so I can't really do anything about the grass just yet. So, yeah, and then we'll finish it off tomorrow, then hopefully it should be done for now. But it, look how much better it's looking already. Look at the fence and that, all matches and things now. And this looks better, and it just feels cleaner, you know? So, yeah, let's get this sofa back. Five AM and we are in 
in trouble But we don't really care Tell ourselves there's always tomorrow But it will still be there No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground I don't wanna do this anymore No, I just wanna say Right, it's now the next day again. <laughs> so it's Monday now, but we're going to get it done today. Even though the weather is rubbish today and it's quite cold, we're still going to get it done. All this here is going to go into the garage or the shed. So I'm going to do that right now. And there it is, cleaner. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to sweep the whole patio, sweep the grass as well. And then I'm going to put all the finishing touches on. So that's the bit I'm looking forward to. So let's go. That is safe to say. No, they don't pick us up. Instead, they knock us down. And that's the way it goes. Until we're in the ground. I don't want to do this anymore. No, I just want to say hello. And do whatever I like. It doesn't matter. Until we're in the ground No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground I don't wanna do this anymore No, I just wanna say hello You may notice as I'm doing this, it's actually spitting. You can see the little drops of rain coming down. Isn't it typical? Second I finish my garden off, it starts raining. It's actually raining now. I actually can't believe it, but I suppose that's Britain, isn't it? From everything we Mm. 
Right, that is it all done. For now, it's the best I can do for now, but it looks so much better. I've got some more solar lights, but I haven't got any hooks for them, so I can't find the hooks anyway. I thought it did, but that's the table with all the cushions on. How worth the money was that now? 150 off Gumtree, thank you. Was it 150 or was it 100? I can't remember. Look back in my other vlog. Got my little candle on there. There's my umbrella ready to go up. All the face fences painted. It's my little rose lights and I just got them from the range. They're 2 dollars a stem, so that's for Fluffy's grave because I had some, but the cat destroys them, as you would have just seen. So that is everything. That's clean now. I'm going to get another one of those hearts for there because I've got a hook if you see. Oh, focus. I've got another one of those hooks if you see so. And there's my little palm trees down there. So it's, but it's um perfect for me at the moment that is so much better and i'm so happy with it and please please let me know what you think because i really will be interested to hear and now that brings us to the end of the video i really hope you enjoyed it i hope you did because it took me three days to do and i've never done a garden transformation on my channel before so i really hope you liked it and um if you did please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see everyone in my next video bye everyone